as we head north, can we have a quick story about Nambour or Nambour? Oh, Nambour. Oh, Nambour. Well, I was born in Nambour. <laughs> that's my that's my stomping grounds. That's where Nan raised me. Uh, played football for Nambour. Uh, but you know the Nambour showgrounds? They were always a big open area. Uh, when the first settlers came here, Petrie came up the creek he saw at least 600 to 700 aboriginals gathered or what we call now the nambour showgrounds sporting games yeah there was a, a actual uh, man making ceremonial bora ring there on on the top of the hill and then where the bowls club is at the school mm. that's where the small kipper was because yeah. they were all connected so there was a real hub nambour was a hub it was a gathering place for where you could go up to the mountains so us coastal fellows would gather there, and then we'd go up in the mountains for the bunya season. But it's sort of like, yeah, it's a very well-known stopover camp place. So in many respects, it was the ideal place to put the municipal centre in the council chambers and the rest of it, because it's the meeting place. That's and the HQ. Place of, yeah, the gathering point. That's it. Um, interesting. Yeah, uh, Nambour in the language does mean the red flowering paper buck tree. And I was just driving along Fisherman's Road about two, a week ago, there was a paper bark with the red flower in it. Mm -hmm. Nambour. Nambour. Nambour.